All right, happy Wednesday. What is going on? I got something special. I got a new toy. So this is the new Trident X remote from Aircom. Um, we had the version previous to this, which was just the regular, I don't know if it's called the Trident or what the actual name is. Looks identical, uh, but the special feature with this one is uh, it has increased radio signal strength. So I've been told it's about 50% better for range than the previous radio, uh, which honestly we didn't really ever have problems with. But this thing apparently has some super range. So Ian and I are gonna do a little tester on this thing a, little, a bit later. Um, it's about, we're using about 400 feet of hose here is what we're pumping through. But uh, if we go all the way down to the beach, it's about 600 feet from the pump. So we'll see if, uh, if we can maintain signal all the way down at beach level. So what I find uh, is really nice about these remotes, uh, before using the Aircom units, um, we had another uh, very popular brand, which I will not name specifically. Um, but the issue was with our climate, our damp climate here, in the mountains, in the rainforest, um, through the winter and fall seasons, water would get inside of the remote. And those remotes actually use removable batteries and the water would get inside in the battery area and it would rust out the tabs for the battery contacts. This thing here, you can see, it's got six Allen screws on the backing plate, as well as an O-ring, I believe. Um, so we have never had issues with these whatsoever as far as for moisture leaking inside of them. Uh, they've been super, super solid that way. Uh, the other nice feature with these is wireless charging. No batteries to replace. Um, on this unit here, it's got three settings for uh, radio power low medium high on the highest setting the battery life is approximately 10 hours on the lowest setting it's uh, about 48 hours i believe uh, so lots of life set the power according to uh, what you need for your specific job but i do know this thing on its lowest setting on the trident x actually has a stronger radio signal than the previous uh, version of this um, just set from uh, the way it was from factory so anyhow we're gonna do a little run through with this thing and uh, we'll see what she's capable of. I think the true test will probably be when we get a, um, something like a block fill job down inside a parkade, a couple levels down or something like that. Uh, that'll be a real run for this. But uh, this site here is a bit of a challenge. Like I said, we can get 600 feet from the pump and we got trees and elevation change and all kinds of other stuff. So uh, we can uh, give her a good little tester here, which we will do. So super easy, as you can see here, I just go into the diagnostics mode, which is really easy to do. And I just select between low, medium, and high power settings. Because we're gonna give this girl a little, uh, a little test run here, we're gonna set it to high. And there we go. So now what we're gonna do, Ian here is gonna go for a little walkie. He's gonna go for a little a romantic watch, walk on the beach by himself. He's gonna keep going, and I'm periodically gonna ask him to uh, honk the horn, and we'll see if we can hear it. And as long as that horn is honking, we are still within signal strength. Jag, can I borrow your radio? I might need this to communicate with our man. We'll just take a little walk down the hill here. Let's see how far we can get from this thing. I think from the pump to the beach, I know I should know how far this is because we actually did a line pour here all the way down there to do a boat ramp in one of my previous videos. Uh, it is about 600 feet with a good amount of vertical drop and terrain. And this actually is kind of a crappy little area for uh, the radios cutting out. So this is a good, uh, a good test for this thing. Okay, Ian, honk the horn. You're still good. So he's gonna go all the way down to the beach as far away as we can get. Go as far as you possibly can without getting wet. I'm 
got the ramp. Yeah, we go part way up where I can hear the horn and then have to get a hop. Okay, honk that horn. Keep doing it. We're good. We've proved our point here, I think. So anyhow, that is about 600 feet. Is that feet. like 600 feet? It is about 600 feet, you are correct. So what I'm really anxious to see um, with this pump, we do a lot of pours down inside of parkades and we're doing block fill. Um, so I think that will be the ultimate test for this radio. We'll see how it performs there when it's got to go through a uh, few levels of concrete slab and some concrete walls and whatnot. But uh, this here, it's 600 feet. I can 100% guarantee you that our uh, previous brand of radio would not go that far. Our, uh, our previous Aircom radio was actually pretty darn good. It would go that far. So this one's supposed to be even better. So we'll see what we can get out of it. But uh, yeah, 600 feet. No problemo in a relatively challenging area. So, so far we are impressed. All right, so we are all wrapped up here. Just enjoying a uh, traditional Canadian treat from Tim Hortons, the apple fritter. Yummy. Ian, what's the best part about the remote? He, he mentioned one thing that was new, a new feature versus the old one that he loves. It lights up. Let there be light. What was the other thing you liked? It's got a, it got a holster for it, like, like a pistol. Anyhow, so far so good. What do you think? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And, and it goes so far too. It does go so far. The old one was pretty good too, to be honest, right? Okay. Do you remember the ones that we had before, the blue ones? We won't mention the brand name. Do <laughs> you remember them? Or you can only get 100 feet if you're lucky. <laughs> we won't mention the brand name. It was more than 100 feet. They're actually decent that way. Um, it was just the, uh, we had issues with the lack of weatherproofing. So we've really, really enjoyed these things so far. So anyhow, that'll be it for today. I'll, uh, I'll follow up in another video here. Like I said, hopefully we can get a nasty one uh, doing some block fill down inside of a structure or something and really see what these things are made of. But we didn't make it 600 feet all the way to the beach today. So that's good. So that'll be it for now. Like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe.